Okay, testing, testing, one, two, three, all right. Quick little recording, not streaming this part, because uh, tracking, tracking, uh, whatever. Do the tracking for now. Uh, the quick recording, because I was removing the masking tape from the shoulder thrusters, you can see tiny bits of paint got pulled off. And so I'm just going to quickly do this recording on how I'm going to fix this. Anything? Yeah, a small bit came off here on us as well. So what I'm doing is just I'm putting some quick masking tape over the little black parts I painted. Plus, I did a quick top coat on top of this, which is like 10 seconds of spray, my spray can of top coat. This just to make sure it seals in the paint again. And then I, uh, I'm sealing up the black parts with masking tape. Of course, my tape's not sticking that well anymore because it's a bit old now, but uh, fine. Blue tack, whatever. Cut! Yeah. Get us. Alright. Resume. So, as I was saying, I had some issue here where the paint ever so slightly peeled off on some of the thruster parts when I pulled the masking tape off. So, what I did was I took all these parts, the four thruster parts here, gave a quick coat of the top coat in like 10 seconds, left it for a few hours, okay, went to work, came back home. Now I'm just going to mask off the small black part here, and then just respray the off-white onto these pieces again. I think this is off-white. Yeah, this is the off-white. And that should be good with the ceiling coat is showing that the next layer does not peel off. And uh, I'm just doing this little recording, I'll probably upload this to Twitch or YouTube when I edit it and see, and uh, yeah, just, just to show that even if you mess up something, it can be fixed. And you should probably do a top coat, not be impatient like I was, and do a top coat before you do your masking as best you can, just to ensure you seal in your colors. You know, you live, live and learn. This is actually the very first time I've, my, I personally had um, paint peel off for, as I removed masking tape, you can see here. However, at the same time, my previous times I did, I've been too overly careful and I actually did the right thing of top coating first, then masking to protect the layer. So, you know, this is me trying not to add extra steps for the stream, but you know, that's come back to bite me in the butt. So just some very quick maskings over the black pieces. And then I will quickly do a new spray of off-white across them. There we go. So that's one, two, three. Yeah. And where's my number four? Here's my number four. Ugh, here we go. Yeah, even in case I don't edit out that earlier cut, um, I've only been recording for like three minutes already, and this is, whole process will take less than ten minutes. Did not seem stream worthy before changing something else because I would have to wait for this to dry anyway before I ideally, I ideally want to continue. So, let's put it back on. <laughs> All right, let's do the quick paint mix up. Yeah, here's my white. Yeah, 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 get up. Was this off, oh no, was this off white or was this gray? This might have been the aircraft gray actually. Hold on, I know. I have the entire body to compare with now. No, this was the off-white. Okay, this was off-white. Yeah. So, coming back, 69 off-white. Quick shake-up. Is my compressor on? Yes, it is. This is going to be very quick and fast, so... One... Two... Close it up. You know it's quick and fast, I have the respirator on. Safe than sorry. This is a carcinogen. Got my booth extractor going and everything. Practice safe spraying. Uh, 
です。Second, there we go. Got a scrap here. Then with a spoon. Test play. Oop. Test play is a bit too successful. I forgot. I have. I attacked my needle and I tried last time. There we go. Now we actually have control. Yep. See that? Spray it out because I. That cool hit. Okay. Let's give her a few coverage coats. Should be inside. Just one coat first. This might take one or two coats, depending. We'll see. And just even it across the entire body, just so I can blend in. Okay, so it doesn't quite match the same tone. We will see. Yeah. Let's begin the coverage layers. Nothing too strong yet. We don't want to pool it. Better have multiple thin layers than one thick layer, and it pools. I'm repeating this both for the viewers and for myself to answer. Well, for myself, so I don't get too zealous. Because I too am an impatient boy. Let's see. Okay, down to all four in one go. Okay, let's come back to the first one and see. Ooh, I've been a bit too too thin on the paint this time. Huh. You know what? Let that dry first. Let's see. Maybe I need to add an extra spoon of paint in. Let's just see what mix it up. One more spoon. Yeah. Two more spoons. That's a very shallow spoon just then. See where you are. The tissue and then just back flow it a bit. We have the mixing. Cool. On the side. That looks a bit better. So let's see. The number two. Number one seems a bit thin. I'm not seeing any flaws in number two anymore. Not quite. But do a quick thin dusting over it. Okay. Looks fixed for number two. Inside. Number three. A misty bit on that left side. The right. Bottom. Yeah, there we go. Building it up. There we go. That looks fully blended in. Okay. Number four. How are you? I can't actually see if she's number four, but you know, quick, give a distant misting from the end, from the edge. Take a bit of blend of it. It's got that nice white color again, which will darken ever so slightly after I top coat it to match the rest. Okay. Ooh, I'm too far. Back to number one again. Distant misting. Get some good coverage. There we go. And there we go. All the floors, pure paint is solved. So now just let these four pieces dry. And that's it. So that, that was just a very cool quick little thing to show that you know sometimes you make mistakes when you paint 
but they are solvable. Just got to think the process, and it's going to work. Ooh, focus. Focus. Focus down here, please. Fine. We'll focus up here. There we go. See? All four pieces are fixed. So, just a quick little recording. I'll try to edit this down and post it on Twitter or YouTube. Yeah. I'll see you next time.